welcome back to another awesome tutorial with me Ken Bessa of course if you've been following me you know I like sharing tips and tricks on WordPress WordPress plugins WordPress themes and everything to do with online business if you want to build and grow an online business I'm here to help you and today I wanted to talk about how customers interact with links on your website so for example when someone is reading this block of text right here they'll come across these two links and below that that there are these two buttons right here so if your readers or visitors click this link watch what happens so as you can see it's already loading on the same page and so if we hadn't finished what we were reading now we've been interrupted so let's go back to that page if we click the second link right here watch what happens as you can see right here, it's opened up in a new tab and the page we were on is still intact. We can continue reading what we were reading and that's what we want. The same case applies to these two buttons. So if we click this first button, watch what happens. Same thing, it opens up on the same tab and it's interrupted what we were doing. So if we go back to the same page again and click the second button, it opens up in a new tab which is what we want because we don't want to interrupt visitors when they're reading information so if we could switch to the elementor editing page which I've already opened up as you can see I want to show you how to do that so first of all I don't know if you already know how to create links but this is how to do it so if I could just copy this link right here copy that and go back here all I need to do to create a link in Elementor is highlight any text I need and when I highlighted this option box will open up here and click this link icon right here you get this entry field where you can paste control V the URL you just copied so there we go then hit enter so now if we click outside we have a button right here and if we save that if we update that let's update that first let's go and now it's a link all right and if we click it it opens up on the same page so how do we make it open up on a new tab it's very simple so if we go back to the editor on the left side right here you will see the same same text in this text editor right here and all you need to do is highlight the link itself and this options box will appear here click this edit button it'll change to this click this cogwheel right here it'll bring up these options and as you can see we have a checkbox that says open link in a new tab so just check that and update it then update down here let's allow it to save quickly and now if we preview the changes let's scroll down to that link we just worked on if we click that link it'll open up in a new tab and our page is still intact right here and here is the new page that we've been redirected to by the link so how do you do the same thing for the buttons right here in Elementor let's go back to the editor so we have these two buttons and as we saw this button is opening the link in the same page in the same tab right there so how to do that just highlight select the button editor then where you pasted the link right here you see a cogwheel link options click that you'll see more options that will appear here and opening new window will be one of the checkboxes of course click that and check it 
then update there. Let's allow it to save. All right, let's preview the changes one more time. So if we scroll down there and click the new button we just worked on, it'll open up in a new tab and there we have it. Those are some of the little things to do to your website to give the user a great user experience. And that's what I have for you today. As usual, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I always like it when people give me a thumbs up. It keeps me going. It's like the fuel for my work. And at the same time, if you would like to be getting these videos every time I post new, because I do that every week, Go ahead and hit the subscribe button and if you hit the bell button next to the subscribe button you get notified every time something brand new is posted on my channel otherwise it's been a pleasure my name is ken vessa peace